Let it run my mood Can't stop thinking of you I watch you Streaming again. Becoming a little later again and again. Sorry about that. Let's get into it. I don't know what we're going to do today. Not really. I've been thinking about my, um, you know how uh, I saw that spawner, that very one time I saw a spawner. Oh no. Uh, <laughs> of skeletons, I think. I think it was, anyways, I saw a spawner. And the thing about spawners is you can make a very, very easy monster spawner farm with that. So, I just want to check uh, very, very quickly. Uh, 9 by 3 by 9 volume. See mechanics. Circle radius, 15.5, four block horizontal, one block vertical range. Uh, an active monster spawner attempts to spawn one from the four block horizontal, one block vertical range. That is nine by three by nine. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It is as I thought it was. I wanna find it again, real quick. And then what I want to do is, uh, after I find it again, I can make it into a very, very efficient uh, mob farm that'll automatically work for me. And it's a skeleton spawner, so it will drop uh, arrows, bones, and bows. Bows, especially enchanted ones I can use for on the grindstone to get a tiny amount of free XP. And the bows themselves, I can just, you know, use them, probably use them to smelt something. Okay. I'm not sure what the real use of a bow is. Yeah, I can't do much. I can make a... I can make dispensers, use it as fuel. Uh, not really much. But it's still nice. And of course, we're going to have arrows, which I can even make into tipped arrows eventually. Uh, oh, yeah, all the tipped arrows, obviously. And but I don't think there's much more you can do with arrows. Yeah, not really. As for bones, uh, I can sell them with them. That might be nice. Or I can smelt them into bone meal for some reason. I guess for the XP. Uh, but the main thing is going to be that it's going to be a free XP farm. I'm going to get a sword with mending and sweeping edge on it. And I'll just be able to smicky smacky smacky them to death. Where is my special cow? Where's, there you are. I was worried about you. You best not leave me. You're special. You're gonna cost a fortune. Anyways, we gotta find that spawner. Real quicky dicky like. So we're gonna have to go into the pit. Do -do -do. The pit. Welcome to the pit to 101 FM radio. Radio Santa Blanca. So this is where I was. 
is this is the spawner right here oh yeah let me just grab that loot don't know why I didn't do that already let me just make sure everything here is lit up to an extent because I want this place to be free of all sorts of nasties ooh that's gonna be hard to clear why don't I have cobblestone on me what is this um okay gonna grab some from there and some from there just to block these off and make sure that ooh, this is a place I blocked off in the beginning I know about where we are then um, but right now I just want everything to be spawn proof uh, all right where did I come from Grab a few more blocks because I want to have a way down. Bing bong. Ooh, that's what it's all about. So not even the shebang bang. Just the stuff stuff. Okay. Uh, now that we're here. I'm gonna clear the area out from this and then okay let me see if that's where my house is that's where the villagers are then cave mode toggle dimension yeah, density readers right plaque menu export map control zoom out zoom in I I kind of want to know where this is. I think it's right under my... Okay, I'm just going to go here. And I'm going to place a temporary waypoint. Just so I know exactly where the spawner is. I'll be able to locate it easily. Just, oh hey look, another child. Looks like there's fun and then fresh ones after the last ones were a bit of a disappointments. Okay, so this block is where the spawner is. I'm gonna need a one, two, three, four, so that's where they can spawn. Water. How much does water push? If I put water in the corner. It's going to push out one, two, three, four, five. This is where the spawn itself will be. One, two, three. So it will only really do three. The thing is with spawners, the reason why spawners are very good is because so long as there's not a block in the way, they can spawn just in the air. So it won't really be a problem. <clears throat> I'm thinking because it's gonna be a nine by nine. Let me just show you what I mean. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Just two extra. Basically, I mean, th this is how it how it should be with the wall. That area is the 
uh, horizontally that they're going to be able to spawn in. Thank you, sheep. Your contributions will not be forgotten for a few moments. That's basically the area they can spawn. And they can spawn one upwards and one downwards. <clears throat> so really, if I had, like... Something, something like that. This is about the area they can spawn, assuming the spawner is in the middle and one up. Um, the problem is, water doesn't reach all the way. It reaches some of the way. For example, if they were exactly on the edge here, it would almost push them in. Problem um, is, almost isn't enough. So what I think we're, I'm going to do is fill the entire edge like this. So the edge that it does push them on is here. I'm going to take one block under here, put uh, um, a sign. So the water is just on top of the sign. And push it. Wait, no. Because then they would go down. And I have to put a sign here. Ooh, tough, tough, tough. I could add half slabs. I want to see how it works with half slabs. I just want to see how water interacts with the half slabs. Because it should be that bad. I think I have some here. The, the base idea is going to be very simple. I go here, half slabs. These are normal side slabs. So they're gonna be <coughs> like this. Okay, something like that. This is just for testing. So something like that. But no. I want it to be something like this. If I put water here, and if I put a sign there, something like that. <coughs> yeah, see, I'd just have signs here instead of slabs. So the skeletons would just be pushed here, and they'd be pushed into here, past, and they go in the slabs. I think that is perfect. That's what I want. So, now that I know what I want, I'm just gonna quickly put some stuff away. Maybe grab some more stuff, because I don't think I can ever have a little too much of these. Eggs. Too. Okay, that's gonna be good enough for now. I'm just going to grab a stack of cobblestone. I'm gonna need 134, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 times just to be safe. I do 3, that is 27. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, that's 27, I want them made into, ah, uh, but, mm, then I need to do one more, but that is quite fine, I see how it's gonna turn out, now I just need to know where I want it to be, like the stairs down to it, or something, because if it is over on this block, it would have to be one, two, three, four. That's the block. They, they fall down somewhere here. Water brings them into a central chamber. Somewhere here. It's pretty far from there. Okay, if I do one, two, three, four, and then they're gonna be pushed into 
here with the same method. So somewhere around here. I see how that could work. I don't think it cuts into either of these. Logically speaking, I could go somewhere here. So we want to go east of the spawner. We want to be building east of the spawner. Back down we go. Actually, mm, I'll make the exit once we have finished part. But today is going to be all about making a an experience based a uh, uh, mob spawner based mob farm mob spawner farm XP farm for all the mending tools and stuff. So this is just going to be a maintenance tunnel for now. We want it to go east, right? Yeah. First, we're going to have to start off by just getting rid of all of this. This outside stuff is no bueno. And the f that will have to be there, but because they can spawn there, we'll give them a fair chance. So we have to fill out that. This is a 1, 2, 3, 4 is that, nope, it's not perfect dimensions. Is that, no. Because I want it to be just one block higher so the heads don't get stuck, just in case that changes anything. Then we have one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, again. I'm gonna line out this. It's gonna come together nicely, this isn't built off of any tutorials that I've watched, I've just made this with my own knowledge of how the spawner mechanics work. So basically they're going to go here, and then I want them to fall down, I guess, to this level. Ooh, ooh okay, that's going to be a problem because they're going to be here, but just in case, going to give them one block room, because they're going to be bobbing up and down because of the water just a tiny bit. So I want to mine down by two, right? Yes, I want to be down by two blocks. I need to have all the sides put together as well. This place will have to be in complete darkness uh, when we finish so that they can actually spawn. It does depend on light levels, obviously. So that is something we are going to have to remedy just as the final touch of the product. But this is honestly amazing. I just love how this works. I love that this is something I did on my own. I gotta fill in the roof. I wanna fill in the roof before I take out the floor. Should have done that already, but oh well. Eh. Jesus! Where did you come from? Scared the bojeebus out of me. at it. Oh no, oh, ooh, ooh. there we go. All good? All good. No leakages here. Now, just want to fill in the roof. And, oop, yeah, I'll just build up. go and that's the roof. It's not pretty <coughs> but we're not really gonna be seeing much of it. Not in the beginning. Maybe if this goes on for a while I'll end up uh, redoing it and making it pretty so that I can look at it all. Then again that would be my lighting. So maybe not. What 
to tinted windows? Do I even have tinted windows? Do I have tinted glass? I do, but I don't know what effect they have. So they're basically gonna spawn their max here, then water bobbing. You yeah, see, the thing is, I don't want them to get their heads stuck. I think it's fine. Wait a moment. Wait a moment. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's not really a problem, actually. Yeah, I think that's fine. We just need to do that eastwards. So we want something like that. Uh, I just want torches in here for now. Cool. Uh, so we're gonna have to dig up this, but we don't actually have to put signs there because uh, when we dig out this and put slabs there, there's gonna be no water here and it's not gonna come here on its own. So I need to dig out this place. Slabs there. It's gonna look very, very weird with the water just hanging on top of it, but that's Minecraft for you. Honestly, I don't even really need to put slabs there, but maybe I'll get some just in case. Anyways, they're going to go. They're just going to be passively pushed into here because they can't swim, they're idiots pushed into here where let me check if I do down by one and I do water there I don't think I'd be able to touch it and then we want them down a main killing area which means I'll just do something like that We'll have opposite forces like someone there. Uh, something like that. Let's start with that. Two, one, two. Ooh. Gonna have to just, uh, reimagine it like that. Even less so. With water coming down. <clears throat> because I just needed to push them into there. I just, oh, sorry. And just block that off. Uh, something like that. Now, obviously, if I put it there, it's not going to reach all the way, which is not what we want. So if we do something like that, how far is that going to push? <coughs> Not enough, I'm afraid. One more. Okay. That's gonna give a little push. I think that's fine. <coughs> or, um... Yeah... It should be. That's such little push. I'm sure these can overpower it. If I put some at the side. Um, we grab the water... Just to get up real quick. And now I'm gonna make that there so I can get up and out. But that is mainly it. Just gonna put that there so that I have water waiting for me. I can make an infant water source with it. No problems at all. The main problem right now is Oh for the love of God. I gotta ban someone. I hate having to ban people. It's one thing I really don't like. You just ban. It's a bot. Bots are only 
just so almost depressing because somebody made that bot and somebody made the message in that bot someone who could never hold up to any of the promises or anything like that just lying for clicks on a post trying to lure people in with desire in a way that isn't convincing maybe if it was convincing if it was original if it had any meat to it at all if it even kind of tried to work maybe i wouldn't shit on those types of things so hard but it's just like so disappointing that you can't even uphold yourself to a better standard than that you can't even do it well you do something terrible. You do a bad thing terrible. There, now I can grab water from everywhere right there. I can place them on the sides. Now, it would be great if it gave like a natural push. And it does! I don't even need this! Well... that off but if it's gonna give a natural push yeah you cannot oh yeah that is just impossible to do on your own absolutely perfect and I couldn't even put slabs there because that's just gonna I mean, well, well, what's gonna happen if I don't? Realistically, think about it. I'm gonna go somewhere here. Even if I back off into this corner, I'm still gonna get pushed. If I go even anywhere here, I'm gonna get pushed there. I heard a little drrrt. Okay, they didn't. That was not good. Uh, that's where I'm gonna have to put some slabs, definitely. <coughs> but that is a work in progress for now. Basically, they're gonna go down here, fall. Do I even really. I don't think I want that to be a like I, I think I don't want this to be a slab thing I just want it to be a thing where they just fall down normally. then again I could make an abnormal one I could do something like Something like this. But no, that wouldn't work. But it would push them into here. Okay, I think I have nothing to worry about because it's going to push them in to there. So I think I don't need these to be those blocks, we just want it to be... Ooh, what if they get snagged? They don't get snagged. Perfect! Okay, then I just need a sign to put there, then I'm gonna fall down here like... Okay, if that's what that is... It's gonna be the layer it's on. I want it to be just one off. just gonna jump up here for a quick moment um, I don't need dirt 
I really weak since I have enough of those. That. Sorry, my mic fell. Perfect. <coughs> We're just gonna get pushed into here. Like that. I'm gonna go down here. Oh no, boohoo, what's gonna happen? I'm terrified. Please don't kill me. I want to live. Except boohoo should have thought of that before you became a skeleton. Because it was totally your choice. Okay, so we're gonna have slabs like that. This is where I want them to just be. And then something like that. Just to give it a real rustic makeshift look. And just gonna do that. And that. And I'm just gonna mine up like this. Uh, because I want to kill them all. Very nicely. No, that's not very nicely. If there's a hole where there shouldn't be a hole. I don't like when there's holes in the wrong places, you know. Now basically that's it, gonna have to put something on the spawner itself, so that they don't spawn there, just something in the way, nothing special, even. I don't know if I can, if I do something like this, where, just break this down. Do that. That's gonna be gripping, but I don't care much. This needs to go out by one. Because I want to have two from either side. Just for the sake of consistency. And I don't know, for myself. If I. They can still shoot me. So I will have to put it there. I don't need beer. I maybe need beet root seeds. I don't need grass blocks. Definitely. Uh, this is basically where it's going to be. And. I can have a possible hatch from here to eastwards. So I'm going to mark that on my map. Set temporary waypoint and remove this temporary waypoint. Yep, that's about it. I ought to get.
puppies, and boom. Get got. Oh, I'm just too slick for you. You cannot get me. <coughs> Is that sounds of nighttime? No, it's not. I want clock. Oh, it is nighttime, but early nighttime. Someone picked up that loom trade. Definitely. It was you. No. I say unto you, no. Was then. Okay, now that it is bright outside. Basically, that and anywhere forward is where I can make the hatch. I need to go right one and back one. If I could do one, two, three. Then that would be ideal. Because it's there. And I go back one, two, three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I like it. A splendid idea. Now we're just gonna mine all the way down there. It's not gonna get in the way of anything. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Oh, Mundo is what I call that. Just look at that. This is not perfect, however. This is quite not perfect. gonna dig up wait I want to count how many ladders I need one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one two twenty two can I make twenty two ladders huh I'm sorry do you just not make ladders anymore I need to use planks of wood now. Thanks a lot, Quark. God, you will leave these guys. Yeesh. Oh my god, I have some sort of door. God damn. You're getting on me nerves. Where am I going? I have an entire floor of crafting tables. The least I could do is use it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Eh, two over isn't that bad. It's not that bad. Gonna put this away, put those into slabs, do those into cobble. Put, 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 put stuff away. Put, put, put stuff away. And this is almost everything. I'm just actually gonna grab some more cobblestone so that I can block stuff off down there and get the final pieces ready and I'm gonna grab water because you can never do anything or go anywhere without water once you have access to it in Minecraft. That is a golden rule of surviving. Water is essential against fire, against lava, against falling, against things chasing you, for getting up and down places quick. It's just what you need to do. 
Now I'm gonna grab this again. Because I forgot to make trapdoors. I need trapdoors. Two of them precisely, which is nice. That it became such a nice number. If I do this, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Oh, that's beautiful. That is so beautiful. And I'll do that. I'll do this. And I'll do something like this. I didn't think. I'll get a bubble elevator a different time. Right now I need to grab my stuff. And then... Okay, well... It's not the brightest want it to be. I could make a further fall. I guess about... I could do this. Could uh, this. Extend it all down. Okay, so I'm gonna do that. down a little bit just because I can I have the ladders to do so and clear up my inventory and also it'll deal some damage to the skeletons. I don't wanna like I know I could, but I'm not all about that whole get them to one health thing. You obviously can, you can just extend this down further. And if you don't have those uh, slabs that I do, the sideways slabs. Uh, don't worry about it not working, just replace those with full blocks. Uh, just be aware that they, like, they might get stuck on the very, very edge of a block where the water doesn't run, but they can still stand like this. Uh, but that's still a maybe, and it's not going to affect your spawner efficiency a whole lot, I don't think. You're gonna be completely fine doing that. You don't need to use slabs. Uh, you can just replace slabs with full blocks. I'm just doing slabs as a precautionary measure for something that you don't need to worry about at all. So don't worry, everything's going to be fine. Okay, fine. Everything is fine. Calm down, everything is fine. Yeah, and then I can just go up. It is gonna be a little bit of a climb every time I wanna go up. But that's quite fine. Now that we're down here, it is time to complete the magic. I'm going to grab this. outside light in here because outside light as well as the types of light and just screw everything close. It's working!
And just like that, the farm is working beautifully. Look at this. Already some in here. They're all gonna spawn. Oh, it's gonna be perfect. Right? What is the detection range of a spawner? What do you think? Okay, so I need to be somewhere up here. Just uh, kind of annoying because I need to build all the way back up here now. But that's fine. I can do that, I can do that. Don't worry about a thing. It's gonna be fine. Just a few modifications. Somewhere around here is where we will be standing. And that. Hi! You are our first customer. Hip. Hip. Ow. I don't have. Minor setback, minor setback. But the smallest amounts. Stop. 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 Stop it. I don't like that. I saw particles. One of you has a backpack, the other does not. But which one? Hmm. Interesting, interesting, quite interesting. Clack and don't need to be around here. You have yourself something that I don't like you having. Yes, yeah, so I was a little bit too low. them to be spawned. Obviously this is not efficient at all, currently. because I wanted your drops and they were terrible. You give tutorial level loot. 
Yeah, damn. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Ooh, I know what I could do with that little downstairs room. I can make that into a storage room for all the stuff I'm going to be getting from that. Don't you think that's nice? Okay, let's do things. Heart, hit, heart, hood. Put all the stuff away that I'm not immediately going to be using, nor can I store efficiently. AKA everything. Yay! I love it. Very cool. Mm -hmm. I need to kill you. Yes, I will. Okay, let me think. I'm gonna need chests. I'm gonna need. Uh, whew, gonna need some hoppers. Hmm. Quite some things. Ooh, let me think about it. Make that a hopper. I need to get myself a sword. That's the main thing I need to do right now. Otherwise, that farm will be useless. At least for a while. Good citizens of my great nation society. I urge you all to give me the finest cheap trade immediately. <laughs> oh my good sir, how kind you are to me. And bing bong! Ooh! I got him. Absolutely fucking fantastic, I. <laughs> For now, I'm just gonna go down, get some XP. Ooh, that's a part of pork I really like. This is gonna give me some old. What? Damn. Got the sea tomb, or backpack. If you ask me, it's just another thing to throw away. this it's this block and it's not even so I need one two mm, yet yeah, two and I make that a slab just to use that slab up I'm gonna create a double chest here then I'm gonna have rows of chests along there for now gonna have something so two hoppers and a whole bunch of chests that's what I need I'm going to be able to AFK there for a while I don't like how many I'm getting maybe I should build like a ring Like that, yeah. Well, I want that one to be there. It's just the first one I ever got in Hathaway Music Discs. It's special. But I'm just gonna create a ring of backpacks. Anyways, uh, the good thing about that uh, spawner thing is that I think it might also have these chunks loaded in with like my farms and my, my iron farm included. Which might mean that I'm just going to be generating iron and growing my crops at the same time, and generating lava and smelting everything, letting villagers do their whole shablam blam. 
which is honestly very nice. And I know I have a whole lot of oak wood piled up, which I can swiftly turn into chests. Oh yeah. This is how we do it down in Texas. Gonna need two of them turned into hoppers though. Bada bing! Bada boom! <laughs> Yep, that's what I call too easy. <sighs> now, down we go. Down, 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 go. Down, 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 down,
That's quite nice. I'm gonna have to go up and get more chests. I need to count how many chests. I first need to make this into stairs. I need two stairs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Plus six, sixteen. Sixteen. Well, no, I can just do six, six, six. That's eighteen. No, that's just sixteen plus eighteen, which is thirty-four. I need thirty-four chests as well as slabs. I'm just going to get a stone cutter and some cobblestone. But I need 30, 36, 34, 30, 30, 34, 34, it's 34, I remember now. I need 34 chests. When did I get music disc 13? Oh, that much space. Wow. Well, it is what it is. And what it is is free off. I know it's been only a good amount of time, but listen, listen. Don't you think we're doing just a little bit too good to stop already? I mean, come on, come on, let's just do a little bit more. I mean, we just got the spawner up and running for us. We haven't even gotten a diamond enchanted sword. I know you want to do a little bit more. I know you don't want to just quit yet. So. What we're gonna do is grab some extra cobblestone. Then we're gonna grab some wood. Then after we have grabbed the wood, we are gonna make some chests. We need 34. We have 32. God damn it. Thirty-four chests. There we go. We have thirty-four chests. We do not have the stone cutter we need. Let's wrap the stone cutter we need, because we need it. Leave the magnets at the door is something I'm gonna have to learn. Also get rid of that waypoint is something I'm just gonna have to do. Okay, down we go. chests. Oh no. I miscalculated. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, sixteen, plus Something is amiss in Lego City. Mm. This is not a funky fresh Friday. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. Damn dog! Get your ass dead. I'm tired of you and your sing songiness. Dog. 
Let's see what we got. We got a free music disc, of course. And some free stuff. Okay, okay. What do we got? We got good stuff. Got that good, good. Um, yeah. Uh, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> Something like that, so I can put those back. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, teen, fourteen. We need fourteen. However, those are going to be cut in half, so we have the perfect amount. We have the perfect amount. Oh no. I done goofed it again. Oh no. Oh, we done goofed it again. Oh no. Oh yeah, I done goofed it again. Oh no. Oh no, I done goofed it again, oh ha ha. I done goofed it again, oh ha ha. I done goofed it again, ha ha. Oh, I done goofed it again. Uh, okay, dokily, everything should be up in the world. Everything is going as it should. This is going to be our equipment box. This is going to be not equipment box. This is going to be another not equipment box. We score. Mm. Damage what I do with the beam of both parts. to keep going I do okay sorry I was just checking that I was just checking that my mic wasn't off for some reason that would have been terrible if it was off for this whole time or just some of the time just terrible Anyways, what I'm going to need is a diamond sword with Bane of Arthur pawns uh, maxed, sweeping edge maxed, mending, and unbreaking maxed. Apart from that, I want looting as well. So I, I just want, you know, a god sword. Nothing, nothing too crazy. I mean, come on, it's just a god sword. I don't know if it runs off or not. Uh, okay, here's the thing. I don't, I'm obviously not at the stage of creator popularity, and I don't think I ever will, but I'm just talking that, like, right now, I'm definitely not at the stage where I can just do a stream where all I do is just farm EXP and talk to my news because it's going to be a VOD. The main point of a VOD. I, I feel like a VOD can work as well if I'm not talking. If it's just me talking to you, I feel like that might be fine, but then again, it's just me talking to you. I could just turn everything down real low 
in game, just talk and talk and talk. Wait for your viewers to come in if any, do some enchanting in the off time, but I feel like it's not gonna be as fun. But I do want to farm. The point of a farm is to farm it. No, not that. If I'm not going to be farming a farm or in a farm, then why did I create the farm? So the question is, do I not show that? Do I th do that off stream, off cam, off everything? Or do I do it, but, you know, it's, it's boring. Because nobody else is going to be here. Still got it. All right, quick run with them all fingers. I don't know. I just don't know. It does feel weirdly lonely when there's nobody here. I don't get it. It's weird. Maybe because I'm talking, but there's no one responding. Like I've just gone crazy. What's the thing that's been with me the longest? What's seen everything? It would be the sleeping bag, technically. Or... Nah, it's not worth it. I don't know why. I'll just keep that with me. No. I can't tell. It is the sleeping bag. Spend with me for the last time. Oh. Tomorrow, go to the X in a Pathfinder map. Is there like something here? I'm at nine. Okay, this is nine nine. But I feel like it's back a bit. Okay, I don't think I can properly do it. I mean, this is where 9-9 would be. I, I, I don't get it. 
It just doesn't make sense. Anyways. I need to make myself a good sword. That's gonna require some trading, some enchanting, some other stuff. First, I need to get some books. Book, 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 book. Okay, I got those. I got... I'm breaking and mending, so I want Bane of Arthropods, looting, and Sweeping Edge. Sweeping Edge is number one, Bane of Arthropods. No, 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 no. I've been saying Bane of Arthropods this entire time. That's not what I want. I want Smite. I want the thing that kills undeads better. Then again, how strong would that be? Would that be two shot? Or... Hold on. One of you sells... Um... Where's my swordsmith? You. Just sharpness two. I want to do... Smite. Smite five. So that I can have max damage on them. I just want to kill them in two hits with Sweeping Edge. Just a norm, norm, normal full hits with no... Crits. With, it's not like sweeping edge cleave, it's just normal. I want it to be a two hit. Plus, just having a high smite would help with any sort of sweeping edge. So, I want sweeping edge three and smite five. I want librarians, I want lecterns, I want books, 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 books. Lectern there. We gotta make our own books, it seems. That is absolutely no problem. Seeing as I have a ton and a half of both book materials and emeralds. Okay. Let me just... Actually, I don't want to keep those villagers. Not really. I don't have to. Who says I do? And I put some there. What I'm going to do will seem evil. Very evil. But I don't care. <clears throat> get your jobs here. Come get your jobs here. One librarian. Get your jobs here. Come on. Get your jobs. Perfect. Now I will trade with this, I will cycle his trades until he gives me Sweeping Edge 3 or Smite 5. Technically if he gave me Looting 3 that would be nice, but I'm not looking for it too badly. I just want to get something good. 14 Mending, I got cheaper. Plus, I have I have two uh, mending, and they're both super cheap. I don't need you to give me mending as well. What I do need from you, my good friend, is sweeping it. That was looting. I didn't check the price. Looting three even. Prop one. Rasp three. Bane of the pots five. If that was smite, if only that was smite, you'd have a deal right then and there. No questions asked. That's Smite 4. I won't settle for Smite 4. 5 or bust. Come on, baby. It's like gambling, except I'm not losing anything but a few s moments of my time. Which you could argue is more valuable than anything. I'm gonna get two of everything, just in case. And this is the part where I do an evil thing. But honestly, did you ex did you not expect it at this point? With villagers, seriously? I'm gonna kill this guy. I'm gonna kill this librarian. First, I'm gonna take his workstation, though. Because I... What I want to happen is I just want to use... 
what villagers there already are. I just killed the last one so I don't have to keep them and make more lecterns. And yes, I guess killing them is just because I'm too lazy. Bye bye Now that there will be an unclaimed lectern, as soon as I put this bad boy down, others are gonna go for it. And I can just get my smite fives. Because I want smite five. I have my swaving edges, I want my smite fives. Come on, baby! Smite five or nothing. I don't care how much it costs. You can cost a stack. You can cost two. I don't care. Your max price is a stack. Your minimum price is the one. If it could be zero, like if you cured a villager enough, or if you had a hero of the village and just traded enough to tip the prices of stuff that they just give you stuff for free. Just give free emeralds. Because the stick train or something is just absolutely cheap. Didn't check that one. Does protection go up to four? I don't remember. I think it might only go up to four and not five. Multi shot flame. Efficiency five for twenty one. That's a very tempting offer. It is such a tempting offer. But you know what else is a tempting offer? Smite 5. I think you misheard me. Smite 5? It's Smite at level 5? Oh, I'm sorry, sir. I did not know that I employed a deaf person. Do you want me to sign Smite 5 to you? No, not Efficiency 4, not Efficiency 3, not Knockback 1, not Sweeping Edge 1, not Lure 3. I don't care if you give me mending for one emerald. You know what I want from you? Smite 5. Or I'm going to toss you in the pit. With you, I can keep cycling. I can spend your entire life here while mine barely passes. Uno momento, por favor. No, you changed it by yourself. You would have had a deal right there. 14 for protection 4. Max protection for 14 emeralds. Smite 1, I will shove that buck up your ass. That was the best trade I could have gotten and I hesitated because I did not... I wasn't sure if 4 was the max. I had to check. I just lost the god trade. See if you guys have any blast protection. God. I threw it away. It's gone. Forever. It It's never coming back. The reason I want smite instead of sharpness is because it does a little bit more damage than sharpness max. Because those are skeletons, so I'm gonna get the bonus. And if I have sweeping edge, I just want to clear them quickly. Especially because I don't have them falling down some stupid way. Because you can't really do that. Because the spawner doesn't spawn if you're too far away. So you need to be pretty close. I guess that's the downside of a spawner farm. Not for 55. You gave me that for 14 last time, and I hesitated. Now you gave it to 55. Fat fucking chance. I might be big dig money rich, but you're asking for Scrooge McDuck's entire net worth for a book. Hell no. I'm not taking blast protection. Or projectile protection. Or fire protection. Or impaling. Or any other enchantment, unless it's 14 for max protection or smite 5 any price think about it smite 5 for any price you name the price think about how crazy that is you define the price and I just have to buy it so just give me smite 5 not smite 4 not smite 3 not any other things at 5 or 4 or 3 a smite enchantment 
at level 5. Or just smite at max level. Almost, almost. I get where you're coming from, but that's not, that's not quite it. Just up by one more level, please. I don't think what you... That's not what I meant. Mm. Uh, no thank you, not for that price. Especially not. Uh, smite. The thing from up above. Or down below, depending on who and what you believe in. The plus protection 4, no. Efficiency 3, no. Leave the sea, no. Channeling, no. Come on, we can be here all day. I'm going to be here until I get Smite 5. I don't care how long I have to sit here for that. You think I don't have free time? You think I'm not willing to sit through hours in the night? There we go, my good sir. There we go. Was it that hard? No, it wasn't. I am still super fucking bummed that for 14 emeralds I could have gotten protection for. I didn't. That was almost as cheap as my mending book trade. My mending book trade. Do you know how ridiculous that is? Fuck, 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 fuck. Fucky fucky fuck fuck Go 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 Zombie, I challenge you to a battle of the fist. Damn. Oh, 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 come on. Oh, it's just too bad, isn't it? Look at this. 360. Perfect. Oh, no. I had stuff on that. Hot. No. I'm not gonna humor you. Not you. What are you doing? Oh no. Oh. Oh no. Uh. Oh no. You wait right there, good sir. Don't you dare. I'll have your head. Hold on. I just need to go get milk, then run away, then kill it, then drink the milk, and come back. What if I get milk from my legendary cow? Legendary cow! I beg for your milk in these trying times. I could also get him to just break his crossbow. Come on then. Get off my crops! Hip hop. Too easy. That is way too easy. Get got you stupid stupid. I see a funky goblin man. 
Is he in my house? Where is the funky ah. goblin man? Goblin man, where art thou? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Ah. Let me just uh, take care of business real quick. Ah. Pay a visit to the iron farm and just. Ah. <coughs> Whoops. Oh, did you just see something there? The villager? I don't see no villagers here. I just see an iron farm. Maybe you saw a golem. That's probably it. You know, the big nose and all. Might confuse you. Anyways, don't worry about that. I'm sure it was nothing. Right? There was nothing. No, let's get to Biznas. Looks like you want to enter the trading game. Remember, I am here for looting three and nothing else. Not one other thing. I don't care what you offer me. Unless it's protection four for 14 emeralds again. I will probably take that trade in for beat. I am here for looting three and looting three only. The price must be less than 32 emeralds. Well, it can be 32 emeralds, but less than would be nice. Looting three. Oh. Just like the doctor ordered. But... Yeah. I don't actually need a librarian with that trade. I just needed you for a moment. And this is slowly becoming my favorite part. <coughs> oh, it's just beautiful. I've been here for an hour and a half just doing this. It just shows you how much I like it. <sighs> ain't nothing better. There just ain't nothing better. Firstly, we shall add to the growing collection of eyeballs. Euclidia is an old seeing after all. Then we shall add this back. Well, we got that back. While we are here, I should put those back as well. I need to make some of that back. Goodness. There we go. Put that back. Looting smite. Wait. Two sweeping edge, two smite, one looting. One looting? No, I. That doesn't sound right. That doesn't sound quite right at all. There we go. Just missed it. Anyways, we I'm gonna buy a diamond sword instead of crafting one because real diamonds are finite. Even though you can get a lot of them and it seems infinite. Buying the sword is technically cheaper in terms of the resources of the world. Anyways, I bought that just so I can un dis enchant it. Uh, let me just... Okay, first I'm gonna bring you. Then... Yeah, I'll leave those. Going to take this barrier. Because that's where I think it needs to be. I have very many things don't worry. I have very many things don't worry, my friend. 
Okay, I gotta be super extra careful right now. Diamond sword with nothing on it. If I put that there, am I gonna get anything good? I don't think so. I'm gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. I best get my good books. The ones that really matter. This is going to be a specialized weapon. One made specifically for one job and one job only. At first, we shall get mending and sweeping edge. For two. Next, we shall get smite. and looting for five we shall put those two together for twelve adding a cost twenty seven oh where was Yeah, Chief. That's not happening anytime soon. I can guarantee you that much. I'm gonna have to farm for that. I should have just made sweeping edge and mending on the first go. But that's just my fault. Go here. Magnet off. I cannot lose those. Those are my pride and joy and joy and pride. Okay. They are coming in nicely. Just like that. And you know what? I'm gonna do stuff off stream. I'm going to farm here until I have enough XP to enchant my diamond sword with the proper enchantments and then I'm just going to use that to make sure that I have all the enchantments on it because most likely what I'm going to do is put this book on it first which is 27 and then just put unbreaking on it at some point after using that but that's going to take a while and a lot of farming I don't want to bore you with that so what I'm going to do is end the stream here. So bye bye. I'm gonna do off stream stuff.